One of the most striking forms of traditional Indian art is called Rangoli, which refers to colourful patterns created on the floor, especially for festive occasions. It has a heritage that goes back for centuries, but it's still beautiful to 21st century eyes. And Durban-based Ashika Ramdin has turned her flair for Rangoli into a growing business. Ashika invited Michelle to her home to see the creative process. Rangoli is an art form developed in India where patterns were created on the floor of living rooms or courtyards using paint, powder or coloured rice. Ashika Ramdin has passionately carried on this tradition, adding her own modern touch. Ashika, hello. Hi Michelle. I'm so excited to spend the day with you. I'm looking forward to it. You look so beautiful. Oh, thank you very much. Now this is such a beautiful Rangoli. Is this one of your work? Yes, it is. This was specially done with lots of love for my in-laws for one of their Diwalis. Now you've made a business out of this. How did that come about? The business part of it came about thanks to a cousin of mine. He said to me, you've got a really good talent. Why don't you expand on it? And then we started off the Facebook page and it's taken off quite nicely from there. I'm eager to get involved. Shall we head on in? Follow me. This is absolutely spectacular, such bright, bold colours. Yes, it is. Come, have a seat. Let's continue this. This is being commissioned by a new client, so I'm just putting the finishing touches on it, and by using paint, it's a long-lasting remembrance of your special occasion. So it moves beyond just being a special occasion, but it becomes a memento for a lifetime. There are some clients who request it to be made specifically on Masonite board, and then they use it for future functions in the family, so it continues and then it becomes part of their family functions. How has it been received by the public? There have been a lot of queries from people in general and a lot of referrals, so it's steadily growing with every day that goes by. Ashika, I know that you have a deadline. What do you have planned for this corner? I'm going to match the colours that I've used on those other three corners. What's the response like from your clients when they see your artwork? They love it. Their first reaction is, wow, it's so colourful and the patterns because a lot of the times my clients will say to me, okay, we have something in mind with like a floral pattern and because they do it freehand, I design new patterns for them based on what they have in mind and once they're happy with it, I then put it to paint for them. A project of this magnitude, how long does it take you? It would take me at least three days of preparation from the time that I prepare the board to designing the sketch and then filling the colours. Would you like to try your hand at Mongoli? I would love to. <laughs> Would you like to choose a stencil for yourself? I think this one is perfect. It matches our Mela logo. Lovely. And the next part is to choose your colours. I think I'll start off with the green. All right, here we go. So I can literally let my creativity run wild. Go wild. Okay, let's shake it up. Okay, good. Some more colour. So there's no right or wrong. This is something that kids can enjoy, adults. And because no one's judging you, you can have as much fun as you like. You can do one solid colour, or in this case, just go with a multitude of colours. Some white for that top flower there. Now you're going to very gently lift your stencil up. Let's see what I've created. Oh, wow! There you go. That is really pretty. Anyone can do it. I think we should Instagram this moment. <laughs> That's a good idea. <laughs> Rangoli designs are an almost essential element of festivals such as Diwali, Tahar, Onam and Pongal. But they are also often created for weddings and other festive events. That was such a special moment. Thank you for sharing the Rangoli experience with me. You're most welcome. I had such fun with you as well. Now as you know, if there's Rangoli, there's a function happening, which means there's food, there's snacks. So we prepared some traditional snacks and some sweetmeats for you as well today. It looks incredible, such an abundance of colours. I cannot wait to sample. But before I do, why do you believe it's so important that this art form is continued? It's a tradition and I firmly believe that traditions should carry forward as long as possible. And to keep you motivated, I have another surprise for you. Wow, this is so special. Thank you. It's the vibrant Mela logo. This is really a treasure. Ashika, thank you so much. You are most welcome. Creating unique and traditional Rangoli patterns, Ashika has turned her passion into a bright, bold business venture. <laughs>